Hi guys, happy Monday. Today, I did some unexpected shopping. And when I say unexpected, I really had no intention of going shopping, but I did, <laughs> nonetheless. Um, so I'll tell you why this was unexpected. So over the weekend, I was just kind of like browsing through like Facebook Marketplace and like Go and stuff like that. And I just randomly browsed for um, good deals for baby. So like you guys saw, I got the Mamaru for, I think it was like $65 like or 70, I don't even remember. Um, but that was a great deal. Like it had never been used or it had, it had been used once or twice and she said her son didn't like it. And she paid like $230, $250 for it or something. I paid 70. So I always try to search for kind of deals like that. And over the weekend, I actually did find a really good deal. Um, I've been searching for a lot of the, like I said, big ticket items, things that I really don't want to purchase the at full price. So um, I found an outlet monitor, you guys, and I had been searching for this like endlessly for a long time and I found it. I'll show you guys. I found it and I paid $80 for it. Um, I plugged it in, it works. Um, the only thing is, it only comes with the, um, the first, the little zero one month baby sock, and so I'll have to buy another one, but I was kind of going to do that anyways, because I wanted the pink one, so, I mean, $30, and I'll have a pink one, so, yeah, I just thought, like, this is a great deal, um, and like I said, if I don't like it, I'm, I can resell it, I, I'm literally out no money, so, Anyways, we went to a part of um, Miami where we were getting this, and there's an outlet store, the Gap outlet that I really enjoy going to. So I was like, let's just go. I had um, Rodney and Kaden with me today. Mason stayed with Debbie, and they kind of did their own thing today. But um, yeah, so, and I'm gonna show you a couple things that I actually just got a couple days ago, um, but I haven't like shown you anything. So I'll just show it to you in this haul. So let's get to it. Okay. Let's see. So these things I got from Carter's online. So ironically, you can get better deals online or things are online on sale than in the store. So um, I had this shipped to my store because they were gonna charge me like six bucks to send it to my house. And I was like, well, six bucks is like as much as the whole thing costs. So I might as well just send it to the store and it's just right across the street from my house. So. I walked into Carter's and I saw this onesie. Mind you, I forget what I buy. This had been like a week and a half. I forgot what I bought. And I, was, I saw this like little footy thing and I was like, that is so cute. And I looked at the price and I was like, $15? I'm not paying $15 for a onesie, what? No. And so I get in my car and I open up the package because it comes in like packaging that you get like if they were to mail it to you. So you can't really see what's in it. So I open it whenever I get into my car and I was like, oh, ordered it I actually ordered it like yes so let me show you which one this is so I got this little cute little thing it has a little ruffle on the tush which I thought was super cute and this is a normally $16 and I think I got it for like three bucks super cute super soft these my kids lived in so these are like worth every dime <laughs> um this was twelve dollars and again i think i paid like two for it and i also got you guys still haven't opened this i also got this you guys which i've been hearing about these sleep sacks and different things and i know this one's not like thick thick but um i did see it for like five bucks and it's normally 18 but I saw it and I was like let me try it like let's see if she likes it it has the little it's just a sleep sack but it's lightweight um, and it's zero to three so I was like let me try it and we'll see I mean for five bucks I can't really like go wrong right like you can't go wrong with that so that's what I got from Carter's you guys I spent 12 something dollars free shipping to the store voila so today this is what I got so you know I got the outlet, got the outlet, 80 bucks. Then today I went to Old Navy and got some cute, cute clearance stuff. And um, so at Old Navy I got this little thing, it's a 612 and it has a little onesie underneath it. 
so for next summer again she'll be able to wear this and I paid eight dollars and 49 cents which was amazing because I had my eyeballs on that for a while and I just I was not gonna it's $19.99 normally you guys and I was not gonna pay that I I just can't pay for that price <laughs> I can't bring myself to it um I found this this is a 1218 it says be beautiful if you can see that you guys 97 cents you heard me and 97 cents um and probably cheaper because i also got um, a military discount because today is military monday and so i got an extra 10 percent off of my i think it was like 12 dollar purchase or something 10 dollar purchase and it being nine dollars so right i get two outfits so then i went to gap and I love, love, love Gap, but I do not like paying the prices, especially for kids' clothes, because my kids get stuff dirty, and I just don't, ugh, I just don't like to deal with it. So my kids usually either get um, like children's place when they're having a good deal, which we have a lot of, um, Target if it's a sale, Gap if they have a sale, but I don't like to pay full price. So this is what I got from the Gap. So, since we just had the 4th of July, they had this on sale, and it was ticketed. It was $7.99, and it was an extra 40% off of that. Let's see. So, yeah, it was like $4 and something. Um, again, all of these, these ones that I'm showing you, I think everything I got from Gap to today was six, 12 months. So everything is for next year for her to wear. This little cute little tutu little has lace on it. You can kind of see this was $8 and another 40% off. So again, like five bucks for that. Um, let's see, I'll show you what I got the boys because I did get the boys some stuff too. Um, these i got this for her just some little things for next summer they were on sale for five dollars and i think i got them for like two dollars and fifty cents maybe a little bit over 280 something and then i got this little onesie that was five dollars so probably got that also for a little bit close to three dollars so i was so excited you guys i spent 26 dollars at gap and let me show you what I got the boys because I have been searching endlessly. I've been to Old Navy, I've been everywhere, all over, trying to find my children some jean shorts that are not baby shorts because my kids are in that phase right now where they are six years old and eight years old and they don't want to look like a baby, which I completely understand. So I just moseyed on over to the boys section and I found these. Super cute shorts at Gap. Super cute shorts. $9.99 and then I got an additional 40% off. Like, sign me up. I will take it. Throw it in my bag. Um, Cause yeah, these are super cute. Like good quality jeans. Um, you can unravel them. You can put them back up. Like I just, I got two pair. I got one for each boy. I just can't like, it's such good quality. And for a little bit over $5, I just, like that's just bingo because every single jean that I've been seeing from Old Navy to Target to I don't even I don't even know where all I've been I think I even looked at Walmart and I really don't like Walmart jeans but everything was like $15 plus per pair and I'm like I'm not going to buy $15 jean shorts for my kids because one we're moving and they actually have seasons in south carolina so my kids may not be wearing these year round and by next summer they won't be able to wear them anyways so i just don't see any reason in spending retail on a lot of stuff like i said all of amelia's stuff that you guys have seen like i've gotten on sale with the exception of two outfits so if you guys haven't seen that video i'm going to post the link up here and check all that out because i literally i think even when i've indulged and outfits you guys I have spent like $16 <laughs> I'm cheap <laughs> I just like to get good deals because I don't think you should be spending all your money on clothes right like that's stupid um anyways I want to give you guys an update if you guys don't follow me on Instagram go ahead and um, I'm gonna put that link down here follow that because I do post week not weekly but usually like bi-weekly 
bi-monthly updates of my sister-in-law with bump pictures and fun things like that. So I'm gonna insert that pic up over here of her. Mind you, just disregard the way pomegranate is spelled because apparently the person that made this app cannot spell pomegranate correctly. So we're just gonna overlook that and <laughs> pretend you didn't see it. But on baby front, Amelia is doing great. Sister-in-law is doing great. Her only, uh, her only thing has been, my sister-in-law's only thing has been she's hot. It's in the 90s in Idaho and she's like, I'm very hot. I asked her um, the other day, I said, has your husband or your kids got to feel the baby in your belly yet? And she's like, I don't let anybody touch me. It's too hot here. And I was like, that's true. I remember being pregnant in the summer and it's very, very hard to cool off. So, but other than that, she said she's a very active little girl. She may already have her days and nights mixed up. So we may have to do a little bit of training on that. Um, <laughs> but my sister-in-law did have a theory that she does believe that her and her husband definitely believe that baby would be born at night. So I don't know. I said, I don't care when she's going to come out just as long as we're there, as long as I'm there, because I'm going to be delivering the baby, you guys. Like, I think you've seen that. I'm going to be delivering the baby. I can't even believe it. And yeah, this week we're gonna be 22 weeks. Like, oh my gosh, it's flying. So anyways, thank you guys so much for following along with this little haul that I got today of everything. Um, if you wanna continue to follow this crazy journey, go ahead and hit the subscribe button right below. Don't forget to hit the little bell beside the subscribe button so that you can get notifications whenever I post a video and that way you don't miss out on any of the cool information. Follow all of my social media and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.